Hi there, all my crafty friends. So good to see you here with me. And if you're new to my channel, welcome. If you want to see various how-to videos, you are in the right place. I upload a new video every Tuesday morning. I'm going to make a very glammy soap dispenser today with self stick vinyl and lots of rhinestones. If you're ready, let's make a mess. The first thing I always do is wipe down my jar with alcohol. It removes any dirt, grime, fingerprints from being handled in the store. And that way anything you apply to the jar will stick. Now that my jar is nice and clean, I'm going to spray it with sea glass ice. This will be a beautiful translucent gray. It's going to have a soap dispenser lid. So before I spray it, I'm covering the threads of the jar with painter's tape. If paint gets on those threads, the lid won't screw on properly. I cut out some loops out of white vinyl with my Cricut machine. They'll go around the top and the bottom of the jar. I'm weeding the centers out of them right now and getting everything ready to transfer to the jar. If you don't have a Cricut machine, you can use stencils or buy some pre-made vinyl stickers. I taped a piece of paper on the jar with markings on it, so I have a guide as to where to put my trim pieces. Now I'm burnishing the trim piece onto a piece of transfer tape so I can add it to the jar. I've divided the jar into fourths I'm adding those trim pieces and then I'll add the ones in between to make sure everything is even. I'm using a squeegee to make sure it sticks to the jar. I'll do the same procedure with all the trim pieces for the top and the bottom of the jar. Where are you watching from? I'd love to hear from you. I'm filming from Las Vegas, Nevada in the United States. If you're enjoying this video, give me a great big like. And don't forget to subscribe so I can bring you more craft videos just like this one in the future. Time to glam this jar up a little bit. I am using Beacon Gem Tack Glue. It works great for gluing rhinestones. It's actually specially formulated for gems. I have my rhinestones separated in sizes. And you may be saying to yourself right now, it looks like they are in medicine bottle lids. Well, you are totally correct. They make the best little trays for your rhinestones. I'm using the most awesome little tool right now to set the rhinestones on the bottle. It's called a rhinestone picker. It has a wax tip so the stones stick to it until you actually set them in the glue. I always try to let you guys know when I find either a tool or a product that works well. And this thing works great. I'm going to add the soap dispenser lid. They're real easy to put together. I picked out a gorgeous shimmery gray organza ribbon and I'm adding that right now. And you might think after that I'll be done. Nope. Stay tuned. make this let me know I'd love to hear all about it and I answer all the comments that come in this soap dispenser is going to be for my sister it's for her kitchen so I'm adding the words dish soap now you may think to yourself this is a little glammy for a kitchen well not her kitchen it's going to match perfectly I'm dotting the eye with a rhinestone. 
And now it's done. Thanks so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe so I can bring you more videos just like this one in the future. And click the bell if you want to be notified anytime I upload a new video. I put together a playlist of other videos similar to this one that I think you'll enjoy. Click the picture on the right to be taken directly to that playlist. See you next Tuesday.